Uh, now, if you were just watching that amazing performance, we do have Yearlings in the studio with us right now. How are you guys going? <laughs> really good. <laughs> That's good. Now, you just uh, played the song Sweet Runaways. Uh, now, you had the album launch. It's next month, and, or this month and next month. Is that right? We've just started on our little tour. Lovely. And we're launching in Melbourne on uh, Sunday at the Toffin Town. Excellent. Yeah. Beautiful venue. Gorgeous. And um, in Melbourne, obviously, you're playing a couple of shows, uh, and I guess around Victoria as well. Mm -hmm. So, some of those free shows, or are they like at record uh, stores or basement, at basements? Yeah, you're right. There's a couple of in store appearances at mm. the last record store yeah. on Smith Street. Are those, Hollywood, are those ones kind of just to, and you're packing actually five gigs into three days. <laughs> yeah. um, how are you going to manage that? Have you done kind of that intense kind of touring schedule before? We've got a good pack. Yeah, <laughs> so that, that helps. And it, well, we've, we've done that intense kind of touring, but usually just the two of us. Yeah. This time uh, we've got our drummer, BJ, uh, who's uh, packed, well, his bass drum is actually his girlfriend's suitcase. grandmother's suitcase. It's a really dear old thing. You can, I don't know if you can see it, but um, so he's, he's helping us with our car pack. And we've got Heath Cullen as well. So it's, it's a much jammier Car. It's a full like, Tarago this time as opposed to a <laughs> two-door car. Yeah. Yeah, I wish it was a Tarago. Yeah. And did those guys join you on the other studio albums that you had? Obviously, it's just you two kind of... Yeah. Did you start off the thing? You met at Tamworth, I heard. Yeah. How did you meet each other music? at Tamworth? What were you doing? Just well, jamming out somewhere. Heck, I was up... Well, <laughs> Rob was playing with a band called Problem Pony, mm. an all-girl mm. trucking band. Okay. And they were playing they Johnny were Cash bad. covers. <laughs> no, they were cool. Johnny Cash covers are great. They were very cool. In fact, it's Johnny Cat's... Cash's anniversary of his death this Sunday. Oh. Oh. So, yeah. Are we going to hear a cover then at the gig, do you think, oh. on the weekend? We could do Ring of Fire. Yeah, we could. Oh, that's what we could. Mm. Mm. So anyway, Rob was up there. <laughs> Rob was playing with these ponies and I was playing with Mr Jimmy Little, that Aboriginal artist. Mm. And um, we just met, hung out, and hey, we're four albums down the track now. Great. And mm. like, I guess, how is the recording process from that one? If um, these two guys have joined you on this studio album and through the live, set. How has it kind of changed and mixed up? Well, uh, BJ, who's the drummer, he, he was, um, he lives in Adelaide now and he's been our drummer on the album, yep. on this last one. Heath is just our, he's being support, our support artist, artist and he's just an incredible musician. Mm. So we've just asked him to jump on and play bass and slide, or whatever else he can. Yeah. So he's supporting so you guys on this tour, is that right? Yeah. 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 Oh, how convenient. Right. That's very convenient. <laughs> and That's hard work cool. for him. <laughs> yeah, plus he's a good packer, so that really helps us in the car. He's played more Tetris <laughs> than you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, he loves right. it. The live shows, I can imagine they would be quite laid back. Do you find that sometimes it's like more of a serene setting, like for a kind of, you know, the more folky festivals? A serene scene, that's a good term. I like that. We'll quote that. Yeah. Might use that on, yeah, on the I press release, it. maybe. Yeah, serene scene. Yeah, like surround sound. Yeah, it can be. It definitely can be. I mean, we can sort of, we can go for it as well. It's mm. not all just the one thing. Yeah. But we do have a certain ambience, I think, to our sound, yeah. mm. which kind mm. of puts the audience in a nice frame of mind, mm. I hope. Or send them to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Be, I was in a nice frame of mind. I loved before. it. I know, I was so relaxed before. It sounds great. And um, you guys do have the album out and also the tour. So mm. uh, if people want to find out more about you, how do they find out? Where's the MySpace then? Uh, they can go to our, you know, our website, mm -hmm. uh, theyearlings.net, or our my, MySpace, mm. which is just the Yearlings. Just Google yeah. the Yearlings, basically. <laughs> yeah. Okay. There's You'll not too many out there. One-year-old beasts. Everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, definitely check those guys out if you can. Victoria, it's five shows. You've got to be able to see at least one. That's mm -hmm. right. I assume. So we're doing Dalesford, we're doing Selby, we're doing the Toffin Town. We're doing everything. Easy. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming in, Chris and Robin. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks for having us. Paul Dempsey now on 1700.